such a wonderful part of the scripture to read where he brings that out. And sometimes we think, well, that was just, you know, a few loaves and some fish for some people then. But think about how many times when we get in, in impossible circumstances and how that God begins to break something and yet that brokenness begins to bless us. And that's what I, I take from that too in my heart. I think, God, you take something that seems so small and you break it and it becomes so much more. And I think, God, we come here and we feel so small. And what little we do feels like it's not much. But God, I come and give you what I've got. Lord, let you break me and let it multiply that it be for your glory. And oh, how so many can be fed from the little that we have to give. It may not be much when we give it, but God can use it for his glory. Hallelujah. God wants to, I don't know why she didn't go ahead and do this, but God wants to take what you have to give and to bless you with what you have to offer. He wants to take what may not feel like much. about leftovers. Yeah. <laughs> oh, glory. There's something special about knowing about what God has done to remind you about what He's going to do. Yeah. Hallelujah. If He's done it for you then, then there's nothing keeping Him from doing it again. Friend, if He has blessed you before, God, He's going to do it again. Hold on. Stand is moving for your life. I feel the glory of the Lord moving in this place. Go ahead and rise to your feet tonight. We're just going to pray right now. We're going to let the Lord break our bread. We're going to let Him break our fish. We're going to let Him pass His presence amongst His people. Just lift up your hands if you can. And let's just go ahead and pray to the Father tonight. Heavenly Father, we come to you as the pastor has shared our word, as the as the sister has shared his word tonight. We're believing tonight, Lord, and praying, God, Lord, break us, Lord. Let us be used for your glory. God, take our little bit and let it be multiplied for your glory. God, let our praises be used for your glory. Let our testimony be used for your glory. God, let our obedience be used for your glory. For there are many out there, God, that need to be blessed. That multitude did not have what they needed when they come. And Lord, I pray that we be that abundance, that multiplication that they need. God, we're praying for those that are lost tonight. We're praying for those that need healing tonight. We're praying for those that are bound with drugs and alcohol tonight. God, we're praying for those that are with disease tonight. God, we're praying for those that are being abused tonight. God, we're praying for those being bullied tonight. God, we're praying for those with the spirit of suicide upon them tonight. God, we're praying for those that are dealing with things oh, that are an abomination to God tonight. Lord, we're praying against the spirits that would work evil against our people. And in the name of Jesus, we take authority by the word of the Lord. Are you helping me pray right now? We take authority by the word of the Lord against the power of the enemy and declare in the name of Jesus that the enemy the enemy's got to go from our church. The enemy's got to go from our household. That the enemy's got to go from our workplace. That the enemy's got to go out of our relationship. That the enemy's got to go out of our body. Oh, I feel this all over me tonight. The enemy's got to go out of our ministry. The enemy's got to go out of our calling. In the name of Jesus.
Jesus, let it be done. Give the Lord praise tonight in this place. Glory to God. If there's anybody that's still in need of prayer tonight, I want you to know this altar is open for you. But I'm here to tell you, God has not forgotten about your need. Look over at your neighbor and tell him, God has not forgot about your need. Oh. Oh, I feel that all over me. God has not forgot about your need. Hey, I thank you, Lord. God has not forgot about your situation. He knows exactly what we stand in need of. He knows exactly when we need it. He knows exactly when it needs to happen, brother. He is in control of our situation. I feel the Holy Ghost in this place tonight. God is going to begin to multiply. This is only the beginning, my friend. God is using this church to reach out to the lost. Let us be the broken people. Let us come humble. Let us cry out that others will be fed. Amen.